Hi everyone, welcome to your PD My Community video for week six. This week we're thinking about the animals around us, the animals we share our homes with, our pets, and the animals we might see when we're outdoors, wild animals. Now you can meet some of our pets. This is Fred, he's my tortoise, he's nearly 60 years old. Here are Sally and Lightning, my goldfish. Here's the guinea pigs. This one's called Daku. And this one's Jacu. Here's my dogs. This is Luna. And this is Tess. Here's Doreena's dog. Here's Sophie's dog. This dog was Helen's, he was called Sam. Looks like he liked dressing up. Think you might recognise this dog. It's Poppy from school. This is Sophie's hamster. Do you have any pets? Let's learn some signs for animals. Duck. Use your primary hand. Put it up the side of your mouth using your whole hand. Duck. Swan. Swan. Girl. Get both hands, put them together, put them under your chin. Squirrel. Worm. Worm. Spider. Spider. Sheep, sheep, goat, goat, horse, horse. Hope you've enjoyed doing some signing. There are lots and lots of animal signs. You could go onto YouTube and check out Singing Hands for some more ideas. It's quiz time. Next you're going to hear some animal sounds. Which animal makes this sound? Was it a dog? Was it a cow? Could it have been a swan? Thumbs up, that's right, it was a cow. Which animal makes this sound? Did you hear a frog? Could it have been a worm or a spider? Do worms and spiders make noises? It was a frog croaking. Thumbs up. Well done. Are you ready? Which animal makes this sound? <coughs> Did you hear a horse neigh? Was it a squirrel? Or could it have been a goat? It was a goat. Okay. We've been out and about on our daily walks, seeing which animals live near us. Watch our videos and 
look at the photos and then maybe you could go on a walk and you could take some photographs that you can share on Evidence for Learning of the animals that you see near you. It's activity time! You might have noticed when you looked at our videos and photos that we all saw a lot of birds. So I would like you to have a go at making a bird feeder. Some photos for some ideas and you could go onto the RSPB website for some more ideas. Have fun!